so the color that the model is wearing is actually very very gorgeous you guys she looks so beautiful so the brand of the wig that I have today is Bobby Boss I have one of their lace front Swiss lace wigs I have an style MLF 158 Bala 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 it's one of them I have her in the color TT VVORC this wig has a handmade deep part about five inches and this wig is heat safe as it does not say how much degrees this wig is heat safe up to but it states that it's heat safe so I'm it's probably up to 400 degrees safe that's the high the highest I would go with a synthetic wig is probably 300 though so when I just took this wig out the package my heart my heart my heart. Oh, God. Do y'all see this color? Oh, my God. My heart is racing. I have a problem, you guys. I have a wig problem. Like, oh, my God. It's crazy because I'm not the only one out there with it. So, this is the wig straight out of the package. And, oh, my God. This wig is just so gorgeous. It is so gorgeous. Let me get it a little close. Lord, Bobby Boss, y'all killing me, y'all killing me. Like I said, this wig comes with Swiss lace. The parting is on the left side. I don't like, I don't like left parts on me, so. But I'm not gonna be selfish. A lot of you left part people, ladies, gentlemen, whoever wear wigs, y'all deserve left parts too. Comes on the left side. You have two combs in the front by the temple. <laughs> you have another comb in the back with your adjustable straps. And the way the parting come is not bad at all. I am not going to pluck that. I'm just going to apply my Maybelline mineral powder on the lace. On top of the lace this time, I actually cut the lace and come right back to you guys. So this is what the wig looks like popped on my head. What I did was cut the Swiss lace and add my powder. I didn't pluck the parting at all. And the parting looks really great. Like, really, really great. This is the wig. The colors are so beautiful. It looks like oil slick hair. I think that's what they were going for, honestly. This is gorgeous. Really gorgeous. I really wish it was on the right side. But I guess I could rock with the left for now. But I'm going to try to put it towards the middle and then the right part so you guys can see what it looks like after I hook it up a little bit. So this is it. Let me just turn around for you guys. That's what's going on. The texture of this hair is not too silky, but it's not too coarse. If anything, is more on the silky side. This wig does have kind of a shine to it. So I think I'm going to go on with some dry shampoo and get rid of that shine. I don't know what to do. I don't know if I should brush it out. I don't know if I should finger comb it. So first, I'm just going to finger comb it and see how I like it. If not, and I want more volume... I might brush it out or see if I could find my wide tooth comb and do what it do. <laughs> Be right back, you guys. So I'm actually not liking its finger comb. It's not doing any justice for me at all. Well, if you want to see what it look like a little bit finger comb, that's how it looks. I think I'm just gonna brush it out because I like volume anyway, so just gonna brush it out. Okay, so this is how one side looks brushed out, and this is the other side finger comb. You be the judge of which one you like. If anything, I like the brushed out side more. So I'm just going to go ahead and brush the other side out. Mm -hmm. 
You guys, this hair looks like some guy tang hair. Like he blessed me and did my hair. The colors on this wig is so gorgeous. Bobby Boss, y'all just keep doing it. Wow, this is so gorgeous. Look at that. What? Wow. All that body, all this hair. It is so damn gorgeous. You just turn around for y'all. This wig is just so gorgeous, you guys. Like, really, really gorgeous. Really gorgeous. The color is gorgeous. But I'm just gonna take some dry shampoo. Ugh. You can use any one you want. The one I'm gonna use is the Unwash Dry Cleanser. It's a little dry shampoo. Um, I'm gonna insert a picture of it. Right now I'm just using the travel size because I just wanted to try it out to see if I really love it. So I'm going to go back and get the big one from Cosmoprof. It is really, really good and it smells so amazing. Sometimes when you have synthetic wigs and you go outside and you come back in, it smells so funny. But this really, really helps with the smell. Like really helps. But the only thing is you got to be careful with it and how much you use of it because it is really strong. So I'm just gonna go ahead and spray the hair now. Okay, that is way more better. Cause before it was just a little too shiny for my liking. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and brush it out. So it's like a huge difference with the shine. A huge difference. It just, it dimmed down the shine just a little bit and that's what I love. And oh my God, it smells so amazing, you guys. Oh, this thing is gorgeous. So this is how I look as a left side part. All I did was put this behind my ear and put this down right here. I really love this wig. I don't know where I'm gonna go with this wig, but I gotta take this wig out like somewhere. So, this one looks like not behind my ear. And I'm just going to put it as a middle part. Wow, even as a middle part, it is still gorgeous. Now I'm going to show you guys what it looks like as a right side part. 